welcome back. I don't know why I keep doing these high pitched hello. 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 Welcome back. Hello. Hello. Welcome back. Hello. Uh, welcome back to the review of Death. Um, so it is. What's the day today? It's the first of June. First of June, two thousand nineteen. Um, and the other day, I saw that Pip Maidley, Maidley, Madley. Not sure. How you One of the two. Name. Sorry, Pip. Um, the wonderful Pip. Uh, posted a thing saying it was a year since Doctor Who on Twitch. Indeed. Um, which was a very exciting time, um, but was particularly exciting for us too because we were heavily involved in the um, talk show. The pre shows, yeah. Yeah, whatever it was. I've fucking produced it. <laughs> I can't even remember. You don't even know what's going on. I'm the producer and I don't know what it's called. Um, Yes. So, so we thought we'd talk a bit about that. Yeah, we thought we'd chat about that because it's been ten years, and we haven't really spoken about it other than we're it's, doing this thing. It, it's um, happened and it's, it's happening, and yeah, it, yeah and that was yeah. sort of it. So, um, how did it come about? Matthew? How did it come about? What well, was the first whisper. The first whisper, and I, I remember, I know exactly when it was. It was May um, because I had an alert about it the other day, and. I was walking into work and through the office and well they're doing a marathon of all of Doctor Who on Twitch. Really? Yeah, apparently so. Uh, do you want to do the do you want to possibly be involved in that? We're talking to the people. Would that be something you'd be interested in? Probably be like watching it and talking about it and stuff. Like, yeah, sure. It's like what 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 are they showing? Mm. Oh, they're showing everything. It's like, well no, what the, all of the new series. No, 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 all of it. All of the old, all of the old stuff. Nah, not they're like, all right, all right, sure. And obviously, that's what it turned out to be. Yeah. So I heard nothing. I heard nothing for a couple of weeks, and then Rich turned around to me and said, "Oh, um, do you want to come to this meeting about this Doctor Who stuff?" And I was like, "Oh, it's happening, is it?" So he was like, "Right, we need to come up with a pitch for Twitch. What we want to do, blah 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 blah." So we had a little chat, and I said, "What about this, that, and the other? Fine, that sounds good. I'll pitch that. They like that. Mm-hmm. Right, we need to record it next week." Off on, you, off on a budget of note as well. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know what the budget was. Um, go off and do this thing. Find people, you know. Like beforehand, we sort of talked about, like, who do you think you could get? And I was mm-hmm. like, well, there's these actors who are the companions, and there's these writers that we could get, mm-hmm. and there's there's fans, there's this chap that I know called Billy, a bit of a knobhead, but he's all right. He'll, he'll, he'll come and do it for nothing. <laughs> um, and then I was like, you know, there's. there's um, it's like the Time Ladies and stuff, you know, all these popular, uh, you know, fans that are accessible for younger people, yeah. like the Time Ladies and ourselves, and then familiar faces for older fans. So that was sort of it. We talked about it, and then I was told, right, we need to film it next week. I was like, Ooh! so I had a week to try and get all these people. Um, sort the set out. Sort the sort set the out. Uh, it was also Bank Holiday. It was Bank Holiday Monday. Yeah. It was the Bank Holiday Monday in May. Yeah. That's how I knew that it was. I was like, oh shit, yeah. So I think I was given the go ahead on the Thursday, uh-huh. and then we were shooting the following <laughs> Thursday. Yeah. Oh, and I had to do my day job. Um, yeah, on top of that, on top of that. editing <laughs> all the other videos. So yeah. here I was, never ever emailed or talked to a, an agent of anybody mm. before. Um, a real learning curve. Um, it was great because a lady in the office um, had worked with the BBC and films at Fifty Nine, so she was a very au fait with yeah. the sort of sort of things that we should be doing. So that was really helpful that Cass was there to sort of be like, oh, you know, maybe put it like this and stuff. So she was she was really really helpful. Um, yeah, so I mean, we, I reached out to lots of different people. Um, Fraser Hines. Fraser Hines. Fraser Hines would have done it. Yeah. But he was. He was literally going away, travelling for a convention on the Friday, yeah. but he was travelling on the Thursday. And Silv was the same, Silv was travelling. Silv was the same, he was literally going to Germany yeah. on the on the Thursday. Yeah. Um, like Fraser Hines said, you know, can we shoot it another day? And I was like, well, God, I wish, but yeah. we can't because we literally have to put the set up and pull it down on the same day. Yeah. Um, because it, you know, the Oxcast were recording in the same space the, the there's, like, there's one studio space in the yeah. Doctor's cast so um, when you went in Matt went in with basically a quarter of his Doctor Who collection <laughs> yeah. um, including um, the Dalek, Dalek yeah Dalek. 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 Dalek and they went you went in and you set it all up the night before yeah yeah it was so I on the Wednesday I got ahead on my editing so that I could spend all of Wednesday building yeah. the set um, and then Tom and Alex, two, the other editors, lit the set 
for me. Mm -hmm. um, you know, and they were like, well, do you know what, what are you sort of thinking? I was like, well, I want purple and green because those were the colours used in uh, more than 30 years of the TARDIS. Oh, yeah. Um, so there's always the Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and even like the little TARDIS spinning little in on the little spinning TARDIS that yeah. Sam Woodall, he designed all of yeah. that. Um, you know, I said do that because it was like was more, than more than 30 years. years of um, really weirdly, around that time before it came out, um, Kevin Davies, mm -hmm. who directed more than 30 years of the TARDIS, started following me on Twitter Spooky. very randomly. I followed him back and was like, oh, I love more than 30 years yeah. of the TARDIS. He's like, oh, thanks. I was like, you'll never guess what, I'm doing this thing and th I've used <laughs> so many of your things because it was such a good you know, basis of like uh, template. It's stuff. honestly, it's probably the, uh, I, it's my favourite Doctor Who documentary ever yeah, met, apart from yeah. Aspects of Doctor Who. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I love Modern Fifty Years. It's Brilliant. fantastic. Hilarious story, and I will never. I feel guilty about it, even to this day. Uh, Katie was told that she could walk from Temple Meads to the office, which she did. Bless her. She did it in pink heels, and she walked on the cobbles of Queen Square and broke the heel off her shoe. Yeah. And I felt so bad. I was like, look, you know. Bill us, we'll pay for them, you know, and she was like, no, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. And I just felt so bad, I was like, what a thing to happen. I know, happen. I know. What that's a thing it. to happen. But, but she, she was, was an, amazing. She was a, I was trying to think the, the other day, I remember quoting somebody as being like this, and I couldn't remember who it was, and now I remember it was her. When she walked into the room it, and then left, it was honestly like a tornado had swept yeah. through the room, and yeah, then yeah, suddenly yeah. you're like, Oh, everything's back to normal again. Yeah, it was. It, she was such a force of nature. Yeah. She was lovely. She could not keep her hands off me, which I was very happy about. <laughs> um, she was absolutely wonderful. Yeah, and I, I, I just adored being in her presence. She was so positive and lovely. And uh, even after we finished doing that bit with her, yeah, she was like coming around to all of us in the vision and just saying, "I think it's wonderful that young people, yeah, are still, yeah, and you're doing like, you know, the story still going on, and you yeah. know, I think you're wonderful that you're treasuring this and saying, you know, when she's at conventions, she." wants to show love and posit positivity to everybody because they may never have had that in their lives yeah. and I might be the, someone's first hug or yeah. you know someone's first oh. kiss on the cheek or whatever and it's just like oh, she's an absolute saint bless oh, she was lovely the fact that we're having this conversation now it really makes my little heart smile immediately sits down isn't she on the sofa with a glass of water and spills, <laughs> spills it everywhere <laughs> oh it's yeah. so funny I'm so sorry <laughs> Are you sure you would like to change your mind? No. <laughs> Bob Baker as well. He, you was, know, he, was, he was really great. He was really nice. Um, and I know, I know his granddaughter. So you, we, we yeah. had a you had a chat, a, didn't a you? Quick chat yeah, about yeah. That. yeah. Um, yeah, he was going off somewhere as well. Yeah. So he very kindly fit us in to yeah. to, to do it. Um, Rich kept saying to me, "Could you bring K9 along?" I was like, "Well, it is pretty big, and I don't know if he actually has a, a K9." K9. It's like, but he created. God, it. thank God we did that that then that after. Instead oh, of doing after the yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Paul Cornell was lovely, and so was Tom. Tom Spilsbury was lush um, as well. He was like, we we basically got towards the end of the day, and we still we shot them out of order. Yeah. So I think the, I can't, the, the first one we shot was the first Doctor. We did one, shoot the first Doctor first, and then Katie turned up, and we did. Did we not do the third Doctor one then? No, we did Hartnell first. Yeah. Then we did Tom Baker because yeah, Bob was Bob about, was and then I think we did. Katie. Yeah. We did, yeah, we did John, and then, yeah, b b the model after that. Because I remember well, the last one we did was was um, was Pat. It was Pat the last one? Yeah. Um, because I remember Paul had left. Yeah, Paul had to go. And uh, Beth was still there, yeah. I was still there, and Tom was still there. Yeah. And we were kind of like, you know, Tom was just like, oh, I'll stay behind. Yeah, he was and he's, so accommodating. Tom stayed behind and he did the the, the last two, which yeah, yeah. you had a, base, a, a, a basic rundown of who you wanted to be on each show, yes, yeah. the different combination, because yeah. we could swap people in and out and stuff. Yeah. And uh, I I originally wasn't going to do Peter Davison. I, you I don't do, think I was yeah. going to do the fifth doctor. Because yeah. I really wanted to do Pat, John... And Sylv. Yes. Those are the ones I really wanted to do. Yeah. And then everybody had requested to talk about Sylv. Yeah. It was just so funny. Yeah, and that was it, that was a day. That was a day of shooting, and then weeks of editing. Weeks of editing. And then the the, the thing that was quite funny afterwards was we were you were told a provisional date yeah. that it would start. So I had to edit the first episode. 
for that date. For that date. Or like the week before the date. Because yeah. Because they needed to approve it. And then you, Matt was basically editing to the week before. But like you had a, obviously a really long period of time where you could work between the fourth Doctor and the fifth Doctor. Yeah. Because that's obviously longer. Um, and then when you get to the sixth Doctor's era, it's like a mad rush to try and get yeah, yeah. Doctor Seven done. Yeah. But... I, we, we were told different dates and then it got pushed back yeah. and then it got delayed and then it got pushed back again yeah. so I think there was like a two or th- two week gap between when it should have started and when it eventually did start yeah. um, which was so, handy because it meant that I could then like, yeah. take, not catch up but get ahead on get the ahead on stuff um, and alongside doing all the editing and so doing all my, all, my, all, my all the stuff yeah so, so in that first period of when we were given the original date yeah. you know I was working late for couple of few nights that week I was there till I think I stayed till like 10 o'clock one night and then it was like oh actually no we put the date back I was like oh I didn't just do that but uh, Uh, it was fun you know exactly and and you were able to get all that footage as well to use yeah so so we had Chris Allen lovely Chris Allen and Crystal D and Crystal you know they were very accommodating with like poor poor Chris Allen I was oh can I get this clip or do you have this clip and he was like can you just go onto the YouTube channel <laughs> and just send me the link to the video you want and yeah. I'll get you the, the, the proper um, file. Yeah. Um, it was amazing. It was really good and, you know, getting to, you know, Sam would all design the title sequence. Which was really funny because when, when I posted a photo of the set, yeah. it had a little corner of the screen yeah. in it. With the with the with the thirteenth Doctor logo because yeah. obviously we've been sent like the uh, yeah um, they, they had to send the um, style the, guide style and, stuff guide and, stuff and all the logos and because Sam which was amazing had, to read through because, yeah like, like nobody knew any of that stuff that yeah because it was all new like all we'd seen was the logo reveal yeah but then we were going through it and I was like oh those are the fonts they used yeah, straight yeah, away yeah. as soon as I got home yeah. and all that kind of stuff and the colours and palettes and yeah. stuff but what I thought was really was really funny was I uploaded the photo of the set with the with that logo in the corner on purpose because immediately it started spreading around Twitter that title sequence leaked oh, for the new yeah, series yeah, and it was like ah oh, yeah. thank god because that's exactly what I wanted to happen it was, it was, that, was, that was good <laughs> and I think people were talking about it on Gallifrey Base they were yeah, well. yeah 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 um, but yeah so you, you edited all that it was all all done all sent off yeah and um, it went out and it went out yeah um, uh, Kitty Manning had to approve it as well because yeah. she because I mean the episodes were like 20 minutes a piece, and I think most of them ran for about 40 minutes, the oh recording. God, uh, but yeah. cases, I think, was like <laughs> nearly two hours. Nearly two hours, yeah. um, So there's so much material that has just never never been seen. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know how, if there's any way to get I that out there. I can't believe you cut all that down. Like, the, how, how, Christ, you were, how you were able to do it. It was hard work. It, was, it, it happened so quickly. Like, yeah. the week before, you're like... So we'll do this, and I was like, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, I was like, do you think you'd be able to do this thing? Yeah, and I got the day off work. Yeah. And a week's notice, which is unheard of, and then came in, did the thing. Yeah. And then it just went out. Yeah. And it was such a whirlwind, and it kind of didn't settle in until I remember distinctly coming home from work, and I was at Temple Meads train station, and I was on my phone, and you phoned me, and said the thing's gone out. I said, did I can't remember that. The thing's gone out, and I was like, oh, right, okay. And it got announced, and we didn't know. Oh, yeah. Uh, and thankfully, I had loads of, like, draft tweets, tweets saved that I could just add the yeah. link to and send out. Um, but that was a big whirlwind of, like, crazy mm. stuff going on. And then you phoned, I think you phoned me to first tell me. Yeah. You didn't message me. Yeah. I was on the bus going yeah, home yeah. and you phoned me and you were like are you free next Thursday? I was like yeah oh I remember that yeah. and you were like yeah, yes this. I remember yeah 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 no I do remember that and then we were going back and forth about like they want it to be like this but yeah. then I want it to be more like this yes and then I was just kind of like hold your ground do this you know yeah, it needs yeah, to be proper yeah and all yeah that, yeah because yeah. I came here didn't I? I came here to your house at what the week before because remember, I drew out, I drew you a picture you of drew what the, the set. set. Was. Yeah. Because you're like, what do you, what's the I've set going to be got, like? I've still got that upstairs. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll sell that on yeah. eBay. I've still got that <laughs> in a little binder. It's a nice little drawing, like you can actually see exactly what it turned out to be. Yeah, yeah. And that was, that was, you know, I, it was really nice. I built the set. You know, obviously, first time I'd ever done anything like that at work. And the amount of people who came in were like, I don't know, you 
Yeah. His set's really good. He, he, he looks like, excellent. Yeah. He was so cool. And that, I remember, like, I remember, and even little things like the cups with the sonic screwdrivers. Yeah. And, and like Doctor Who magazines on the table. And dapples and yeah. character options. Target and novels and annuals. I remember. Cybermen heads. Yeah. I, I, lo- I love that photo of us with the Doctor Who. That's magazines. a really nice. It's photo. a really really nice yeah. photo. Thank you to Beth for taking that photo. Yeah. There's some lovely photos from yeah. from that that shoot. And I remember I remember sending it. To, I think after I built the set, I set up when it was all lit. I remember sending photos to you and my brother. Yeah. I think I might have sent one to Crystal as well and been like, oh, yeah. look at this. And she was like, oh my God, where's that? So I was just in our office. Yeah. It's like, what? Um, yeah, so it was it was really good. It was a, a really good, good time. But the bit that they don't know about mm. is that originally on the day that Survival was going to be going out. Oh, yeah. We were going to do another show. Mm-hmm. There was a live show that never happened, and that was going to be like rounding up a the whole thing. The, a rap, and it was going to be us two. Um, Paul Cornell was going to do it. Mm-hmm. Um, Tom couldn't do it. Uh, I don't know if Jonathan might have was going to come, and it was also going to be. Um, Sophie Isles was also going to come and do it. Um, I remember now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> it was really good because at the time in the office, we had a big sp- spin wheel. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I spent, like, the day... No, it wasn't the day before because that was going to be on the Tuesday. And this must have been about Wednesday. I got all these high-res pictures from the BBC and of all the doctors and cut mm. their heads out. And I was going to cut their heads out. We were going to stick them on the this wheel, and we were going to go through each era again, but like uh, in a different order. in a different order, and like talk about all the memes and all that kind of yeah, stuff, yeah. all the stuff that had come out of doing this event, it's like London nineteen sixty five, like all that kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, like IKEA, and I love that like Pip got involved and did the he did the trailer, the trailers. Yeah, and stuff. It's brilliant. And it was it was, it was like. Before you go on to talk about that bit, the, the way it gained momentum yeah. through, and like everybody started getting involved in it, it was so good. And it was like an event to like watch people's opinions of all these episodes go. Yeah, and you could kind of see the memes starting. Yeah, through them, like uh, I can't, I, I, there's definitely the there's uh, salami sandwich. The salami sandwich. One. The one with the white hair was another one. Um, oh, oh, the I'm, one that I'm not going to let you stop me now. Was that in there? That might have been. I can't remember that. The one I liked was William Hartnell about, um, believe me, I know. And it was the people who he knows. He knows, he knows. <laughs> believe him, he knows. Yeah, yeah. I love that. Um, yeah, so we were going to have this bloody spin wheel, and the idea would be that we'd spin the wheel, and yeah. whatever doctor it landed on, right, we're going to talk about the third doctor now. Rather than just going, all right, let's go from Hartnell. Because that was there, yeah, yeah. Because we'd, we'd done all that. With the, exactly. The um, but unfortunately, that wasn't able to happen because. Dad passed away yeah. on the Sunday before, mm-hmm. um, and it was just like, "There's no way that I'm going to want to come in and do this." Absolutely. Um, and, and I mean, you were you were doing that while he was unwell, like the whole yeah yeah the that whole was pre-production the that and was stuff. all going on yeah. And we even said afterwards, like, it was amazing that you had that happening yeah. then. It, yeah. You know? yeah. Yeah. That was the, the incredible thing. It's like. So we recorded it in the May. Dan actually wasn't too bad. He seemed mm. all right because he helped me move the Dalek and yeah. stuff. And then into the studio. No, no, like well, he moved it in, into the... in, from the house. Yeah, 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 put it in the garage. And then June, he started going yeah. downhill. So when I was doing all the editing, because I remember I'd come home and I'd show Jonathan and yeah. Dad and Mum. I'd be like, "Oh, this is the show. Do you yeah. want to watch it?" Because um, like, he did watch all of them. Yeah, well, most of, most of them. Um, I think he did watch all of them. Yeah, I think he probably did. He didn't. See- yeah, he's, yeah, he definitely he definitely seen. Yeah, he did because I remember him watching the one yeah. with Johnny on it. So yeah, he'd, he'd seen them all. Um, yeah. So yeah, and then then end of July. Yeah. Twenty second. That was it. Mm-hmm. Passed away. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that was uh, it. Was a shame because it sort of. It ended the whole thing. There was like, there's a bit of a cloud mm. there. I got um, that as well because I, it was funny that w- when you kind of go through it, it's like this is the last day of Doctor Who on Twitch, and then you but you know as well that it's also happening somewhere else. Yeah, and it's still kind of running on. Yeah, and I remember that that the, the last like 
two weeks of that I don't recall yeah. really because because yeah, what, what was going, going on, on yeah um, um, the one of the regrets I do have about it yeah. from like a concept perspective was I think it probably would work better as an after show yes yeah like maybe just totally. a quick introduction to say stay around stick around after, after this, this run yeah. we'll do this yeah. because a lot of people when they would start you'd see the comments going up saying don't ruin it and then you got the countdown in the corner they'd have to yeah. mute it and it was like yeah. that, is, you know, that is the problem um, and I, I, I said that to to the people at work afterwards but they, unfortunately that was just what Twitch wanted they were like yeah. we want a pre-show and we want you to talk about these things yeah. what stuff should we be looking out for you know talk about this that and the other so it was like well it was a Twitch thing so yeah you know yeah. and there's like well you can't you can't escape spoilers if mm. you're going to be talking about this stuff um, because otherwise we're gonna, oh look out for that monster yeah exactly. then, you know what can, what can you say yeah um, but yeah I would have much preferred it to have gone out um, as a as an after show thing yeah. it would have made a lot more sense originally we had pitched to Yogs about, about making, making the review of death, death there, a we? live Twitch thing, yeah, 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 and kind of migrating it to Yogs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, wasn't it? Because I remember having that conversation, and then that came up like yeah, a month or two later. And then, and then I was like, hey, this is our gateway of doing the thing for Yogs. Yeah, and then it never, it never happened. happened no. But you know, if you, you know, you've you've pitched loads of stuff to Yogs as well about doing yeah different bits and pieces. We were going to do that, that thing. thing. Just have to see if it ever happens. happens yeah. Um, and yeah, like you know, if you if you guys want to see the the new series one, because I'd love to I'd do love a new series. I'd love one. to do a new series one. I think I've, I've got a good idea of the guests. I think we should have on it as well. Yeah. We were talking about some stuff earlier as well. Um, but if you guys want to see something like that, then petition and write to your MPs, your local MPs, <laughs> and try and get this action yeah. actioned, this motion actioned. It would be good, wouldn't it? It'd be good. Yeah, because there's been three doctors. Mm. That's Three after shows. Exactly. And I'd want to do it as after shows, not pre shows. Not pre shows. Well, yeah. you may want to do that, but I couldn't possibly comment. <laughs> Maybe we could put the TV movie in there as well. Yeah, oh yeah. Because then. Nice little lead in. Yeah. Definitely. I think that's probably all we have to say. That was on that. That. Yeah. Um, that was a thing that happened. Maybe it'll happen again. Maybe it'll happen again. Who knows? Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you for watching. <laughs> bye bye. Macrans. Yeah. Oh, ice warriors. <laughs> ice warriors.